Hi, Mike Thornton here from Production Expert, and I'm back with a new post-production related test of my new MacBook Pro with an M1 Mac system on a chip with 64 gigs of unified memory. For these tests, we're going to use a different session. This is an older Avid post-production demo, and it's an excerpt from their spy spoof Agent Zero. Now, the original session used 130 voices. And so for this test, we wanted to try two different things. Firstly, how did the MacBook Pro perform when used with an HDX rig compared to using core audio? And secondly, to see how it performed either with Avid DNX HD video or an H.264 MP4 video. We also wanted to push the MacBook Pro to its absolute limits. And after extensive experimentation, we found that by duplicating audio tracks in this Avid session, we could take the voice count up from 130 voices to 1500 voices. What you'll be looking at is an excerpt from Avid's Agent Zero session with a grid of four different system usage windows. Top left shows the performance of the session using an Avid DNX HD video with my HDX1 system. Bottom left is also a system usage from a session with my HDX1 system, but the difference here is that the video was an H.264 MP4 file. Top right shows the combination of a DNX HD video and using Apple Core Audio. And bottom right finishes off the matrix and shows the performance of an H.264 MP4 also with Apple Core Audio. So let's see what happens. And the first thing that we definitely notice is that the session running on the HDX systems is definitely more efficient. We're already looking at sort of 95% versus sort of 78%. Barging through doors is not a good idea, Zero. You've got three tangles up the stairwell. Yeah, I see them. But also what you'll see is with the core audio files, both the DNX HD and MP4 files are hitting the 100%. You'll see that the total CPU usage spikes and shows red. But in no cases does the video stop. Come on, come on, damn it. Forget it. Take this I see you again, Jim. Okay, we'll stop the video there. And there you have it. There's no doubt that like the test that we did with the Soul Levant session from Netflix, that using an HDX card, even whilst using it in hybrid engine mode, significantly reduces the load on the computer. However, the performance difference between using an H.264 or an Avid DNX HD video is less clear. Whatever the reason for that, though, there's no doubt that the power of this computer is phenomenal. We were playing 1500 voices and a video, all playing off the internal hard drive. And that, for me, is astounding. If you want to know all the details and what we did to make this test, then do check out the article in Production Expert. I'll see you again soon.